in response. Hello and welcome to the day. Thank you for spending your time with us. What are we doing today? We are opening our second box of Ultimate Masters. This is Jake's box. Oh my, yeah, I uh, forgot. I'm Jake. I'm Joel. Welcome back to another episode of Jake and Joel are Magic. So we opened my box. If you haven't seen that video, there's a card right. Let me get the camera right, right there. There's a card. Go and watch that video. We are going to open up a second box. Whoosh, Ultimate Masters. We've got that to live up to. Yeah, we've humble, got, we've humble got brag, that. ancient tomb. No, it's a good flex. Yeah, and, uh, it's a, it's a, it's an okay flex. It's a, no, it's one the, of the top the six. Is, yeah, top six box toppers for sure. We determined. We hope anyway. It's like I number hope six. Anyway. But it's a, it's a great, it's a great box topper. And Joel's box was lit. We're hoping uh, for top he, five. He back half was lit. First half back, was ugh, very buttons. medium. But let's get into it. Let's yeah, go. we've let's got go. a, we've got a lot to do here. Titles are going. And so. Uh, All right. So, so this is uh, in your in your world. What do you want? Right. What are you like looking for out of this? And I'm not talking like your maximum value. I want the I want a fucking really not a foil ultimate no, master. No, two sided. Uh, what I'm, I'm like, what, what I'm want? looking for is I would love to get the foil new demonic tutor. A f like a regular foil demonic I, tutor I, I, or, I, I, box or, or a box topper. Oh, so wow. So I'm not even. The moon here. Well, no, no, no. Because you know you have Liliana, you have Snapcaster Mage, you have Tarmogoyf that are all more valuable. I'm just. You know what is in here. We're gonna find out at the end. Yeah, watch the tuned. watch the video. Stay tuned. Um, let's uh, let's just go ahead. We're gonna get into this. All I want is only one dud mythic. Is this mine? Yeah. This will be my pile. Here you go, sir. On the top. All right. And, uh, uh, you started us off for my right. box, so yeah. I'll start us, start us off. off. So uh, we're gonna put the all of the. Kind of like yeah, you will notice like these packs. Uh, I did mention it in the first video, but uh, the packs are like a little loose. But then also, and they're Japanese style uh, the, in many more ways than one. Yeah, the card. Yeah, the they pretty much. I don't know if they were printed in Japan. Maybe, maybe they just did it in Japan. So the rare is up front. The cardstock is better according to reports. It's a purple core cardstock, so you'll find that all of the non endless rest and a maelstrom pulse. Hey, it's a playable card. Off the rip. That's not bad, my man. But it is purple core and it's Japanese cardstock. So, so got a buried alive, sigil of the new dawn, and a miraculous recovery. Those are cards. Those are cards. So it's got the purple core stock. Yeah, it's just it's core it's gonna, stock. The uh, non foil cards are just they're not gonna they're not gonna work for anything. They're just right. really good. All right, so we got an ooze and a pulse of miasma. Morassa. Oh, Morassa. RTC, bro. God, you know RTFC. The thing is, the thing is, is I hate <laughs> the YouTubers that don't even read the card and they just say random. Pulse words. of my asthma. I just missed. Oh. Oh. oh, nice. Hey, not a bad, not a bad second rare. Yeah, no, not at all. We are off to a off to a solid start. We get oh, also in that pack. Good, just we, we're like shrugging them off. Young Pyromancer, Chainer's Edict, and Eternal Witness. Nice. That are just all heat uncommons. Foil, slippery boggle. Oh, that's pretty cool, dude. I'm actually so hyped on that. That's pretty cool. And then, Mario's vengeance. So so far, so no far, real solid. misses. No, yeah, no solid, real misses. Solid, solid. Lava spike, forbidden alchemy, and Sherry. Lava spike, also a good card. All right, still no mythics, but you know we're we're early into the box. It's a zombie. Three packs. Songs of the Dam. Ooh, that's kind of cool. The rare. Rexian Tower. All right, all right. So we're uh, we're staying strong here. We find a Counter Squall, Urban Evolution, Anger, all very relevant to the cards. Spark Elemental is your token. Iridescent Drake is your foil. And through the breach. Whoa! We are rocking and rolling on the rare so far. Rocking man. and rolling. I told you, you have way better luck at this. Here doesn't drink, Garna and Murderous Red Cap are your uncommons. If you watch our 2017 Modern Masters number two box opening, you will see that that box was lit and we're hoping that it stays on track <laughs> for that. Here we go. It's a homunculus and it is a fiery temper. The rare, vexing devil, very medium. First medium. I can't really complain. No. Especially with what you've gotten so far. Living lore, appetite for brain snake umber. Zombie is your token. Your foil is Golgari Brown Scale. Come on, Mythic! 
That is awesome. All right. You asked for it, and it provided. Not complaining about- Songs of the Damned, Angel of Despair, and Uncommon. What the hell? Uncommon, Angel of Despair, Rock and Roll. That's what and I want. Sleight of oh, Hand. Oh, Sleight of Hand. Nice. Very good card. Cool art, too. Very good card. Very cool that art. That is the 8th edition. Jim Murray, I believe. Yeah. Jim Murray with the cool Sleight of Hand art. All right, we're keeping it going. So far, no cards where I've just been like, man, that really is a bummer. It's get it a mere servitor. servitor. God, it could have been. Well, you never know. You never know. And the rare of Woodfall Primus. Woodfall Primus. A card that has dropped a lot in value, but actually a very so, relevant good card. Yeah, really relevant. Partisan of Kozlik, Cool Speed, and a reviving. And Woodfall Primus immediately goes into your EDH uh, Ghost Chief deck. Oh, it's already in there. But oh, yeah, exactly. it, if, it, if it weren't, it would it would definitely be going in. Soldier token. Foil is a frantic search. Rare. Cool foil. Sublime Archangel. So this was downshifted from Mythic to Rare. Yes. Uncommons. Spider Spawning, Laboratory Maniac, and Boar Umbra. Very relevant in Boar. Competitive EDH, but probably not that expensive. Ugh. They put in this set, side note, Basking Rootwalla and Wild Mongrel. That was one of the big standard combos when I started playing. And they're both in here? In tournament magic, yeah. And they're back as like a... As like, like a hey, theme. remember us? Right. So that's exactly uh, what we talked about in the first video. If yeah. there is like an archetype and you think like, hey, that's a thing. My very fir first ever tournament deck, tournament professional GP magic deck was red, green, Basking Root Walla, Wild Mongrel, with Lava Axe. Lava Axe was in that deck. <laughs> well, the Lava Axe was, yeah, was a card where people card. were like, yeah, yeah, you play that. Right, yeah, it does my damage. <laughs> that's crazy. All right, next pack. We got a spider and a foil defy gravity. And our next card is the Spoils of the Vault. So that's that's a miss, but that's okay. We have a Dawn Charm and Unburial Rites, which is Jake, relevant. Jake, they can't all enough. be absolute heat. I know, you're right. Some of the packs have to be not heat. You're right, you're right, you're right. <laughs> that's how these boxes work. Ooze. I mean, look at my whole first half. Shielding plaques. Okay, so again, the foiling in this set is not that great in my opinion. No. This is the second time that it's actually been... I have to be completely... Very I have to completely to agree with you. The foiling is kind of long. Um, the 2000... Rares are back to basics! Yay! Made it all better with the back to basics. Um, I, I have to agree with you, though. Uh, it reminds me Boggle, of... Spirit Karn, Brawn. Nice. It reminds me of 2015 Modern Masters. It's just very bland foiling. The cardstock on that was way worse than this cardstock. You can't really tell that it is foil without really One, giving it a lot of attention. 10, 11. All right, so good count. This is our middle pack. This is our first 12 of the 24. Let's see if it can be something good. It is a foil. Lotus Eye Mystics. What? I don't know who that. Who no that? Who that? So and a stirring wild wind. Hey, they are what they are. They are what they are. They'll go into your folder for years and then find their way into an EDH deck where they will live forever. It is an EDH card. Absolutely. Of so course, thankfully, it gets to live as an EDH don't, card. Don't That's forget good. to stick around till the end for the ultimate box topper opening. Yes, we will be opening the box topper. I'm going to keep this gravy trainer rolling because the train right, kept rolling. Here we go. We're in the long. second half of Zombie the Zombie token. Foil devoted Drew. Oh! Oh! That's, awesome. that's a great. But look at that foiling, man. I'm just. I oh, know. This set. I'm not yeah. shitting on this card. I'm just saying the set's foiling is so wow. But yeah. you can sell it as a foil devoted Drew, I'll tell you that. Because look, it's a lot of claw reaches. <laughs> look, we got the back to back stirring wildwood lava claw reaches. I did that in my box. Make sure you go watch that one. We got Dane, Dreamscape Artist, War Leaders Helix, and Artisan of Kozilek. Cool. EDH card, but the thing is, is that that foil is pretty rad. That's a pretty rad foil, and foil slippery boggle is uh, pretty sweet as well. This is part of a infinite combo in competitive EDH. Oh yeah, yeah. Devoted? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. It uh, actually found infinite status in modern as well. I oh nice. Well, and it was a common. Oh, it's a generator servant. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it is kind of a it is kind of a sad yeah, foiling. Like it leaves a lot. Foiling. Yeah, that's that leaves a lot to be desired. It's seems like, like nothing. Hmm. All is dust. It's a good rare, good relevant EDH card. Good relevant rare. Stream of consciousness. Rolling 
Assembler, and Grave Strength. It is interesting from a non-finance standpoint with this set how most all of the rares and mythics will find their way into something. Yep. I'm not going to have many cards from Ultimate Masters just sitting in my folder forever. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's true. Even if nobody wants them to trade. Look at this. Blackstones of Tracare. Okay. All right. Even if nobody wants to Lava Spike, become a Mince, and Golgari Charm, so two, two hits there. Those are good. Um, even if nobody wants to trade with them or buy them off of them, how many packs are left? They are going to find their way into... Oh, I four. I need one of those. Oh, there you go. All right, I'll go now. Yeah, that's true. It'll find that it'll all these all these cards would find their way into an EDH deck probably. Yeah, I would have to look at them more specifically. Ooh, very broken. There you it's go. Cool, cool token. It is a. F have we seen your foil rare yet? No, we no foil we rare, and okay. we're still we'll looking for like another another mythic. We'll get it. We'll find it. And it is a pattern of rebirth. Look at that tree snow and art. Yeah, that is. Really cool. Prismatic lens, billiard worm, and food. Very cool. All right, let's uh, let's turn on the heat here. We need to turn some heat on for the rest. You can of this tell box. it's Therese Nielsen art if geometry is a huge part of the art. Yeah. <laughs> Spider token, foil eighth or snipe. That's pretty cool. Um, that card is in a lot of things, Ray Dawnbringer. It is what it is. Shriek Maw, Malevolent Whispers, and Phalanx Leader. Plus, mm, there's nothing good at the common spot. Okay, so mine was bad first half, good second half. Yours has been good, good first, first third. Yeah. And, weird yeah, middle. Yeah, weird middle third. Yeah, yeah. We're looking for the finisher. But it's got to go up from here. We're still looking for a foil rare. We're still looking for a uh, mythic. Eight packs left. Let's go. Let's go. Let's yeah, go. Let's do it. We just got to do it. Oh, no, you go. You go, and it's me. I'm at three. Oh, you're at three. Okay, it is me. All right, we're at our last seven packs. Okay, We here still we go. have the box topper. This is a thing. It's going to be a thing. Here we go. Come on, dude. Let's just, can this box like get crazy again? Dark Dabbling, Talrind is not good. <laughs> Boring. Your first third was rad, dude. We're gonna have, I'm promising you, we're gonna have at least two more hits on this box. All right. And then your box topper's gonna be top five. All right, all right. Look at that God's willing foil, <laughs> like I promised. Hey, Dark Depths. Right. That's a pretty fucking good mythic. That's a good. Excuse my language, That's YouTube algorithm. I don't think our audience cares. <laughs> Dark Depth Legendary Mythic. I love this. I love the art on it. I love that it's got the legendary frame. I love that I printing. can trade you for the token. Yeah, I love that I got the token in the first box. Go watch the first box. Link right there. You can. This art is absolutely sick. Yeah, I think the art is really cool on it. Really big fan. Nice All hit right. on that okay. mythic. All right, I so told no, you we were going to have at least two or three more hits. No misses. Heat doll, iridescent drake, penumbra worm. Nice. All right, here we go. A furnace celebration. Got two packs left. That's a cool card. A light from the world. Nice. There we go. Relevant. There we go. Desperate ritual, also very good. Golgari thug, devoted druid. Hey, hell yeah. All the commons Upper are Upper middle class pack right there. Hey. Upper pretty, middle class pack. Pretty good pack. <laughs> Dramag angler, hanging out. Here we go. I'm getting oh. better and better at opening these weird packs. All right. Spirit token. It's a double cleave. I already showed you the Magus of the Bazaar. Magus of the Bazaar. It's a Bazaar Magus. Fecundity. Travel preparations in Marang River Prowler. Pretty good on commons. Fecundity is a EDH step staple. Gurmag Angler. Yep. That's good. There's going to be a lot of Gurmag Anglers in there after this. Foil Seder Wayfinder. Oh, yeah. There will be a lot. It's, it's being pretty good. Platinum Empyrean. Hey, you said from the outset you want one hit mythic and one miss mythic, and there you go. There it is. You nailed it. It's not bad though, it's middling. Yeah, it's middle. It's not a dollar. It's medium. It's not a dollar. It's medium. Mythic. It's it's high expectations to uh, to be like, I want the the Modern Masters 2017 2 box opening. Yeah, but homunculus. Foil Shiri, I'm just, dude, even, especially with black cards, yeah. the foiling is just, ugh, in this set. Uh, that's my takeaway. Demonic oh, Tutor! There we go. There you go. That's a good card. That's that a good card. is a good hit right there. 
That is a good card. Yes, it is. Firewing Phoenix, Darkmore Salvage, Shere, Shiraz, Kartaika. All right. Last, last pack. pack. Here we go. And then we got Before the box Before the open. last pack, this right is the penultimate. After. We will have the box topper opening. Here we go. Here oh, we go. Be a hit. Be a hit. Bro, it's the last pack of the box. Yeah, we're going to get this here. This we is... need to see a Liliana. This is going to be a freaking Liliana. In the box, me. this is the bottom left pack Plus of it. the box. Here Come we on. go. Oil, winged rider, and it is blue. Glenn Lendra. It is a not freaking bad. Not a bad pack. Not a bad pack by any means. We find an unstable mystic revival sting of Spider. All right, now with our first box, we had a, a very like, oh, it's all right. Now with our second box, can opening the box stopper bring us to that good feeling? Yeah, let's do it. We'll let's see. see. We'll test it. This is all FOMO effort, buddy. It's, open uh, that, open that shiz. Open that shiz. It's time. All right, here we go. Make sure the card is. God, oh yeah, you're right. I just, I just like to freak, freak me out with this. Just like to freak you out there. You're just like, I'm gonna cut it down the middle. Yeah. That's how you make sure it's open. All right, let me make sure about which way it's facing. Yeah, be careful. Did you see it? No, I did not see it. All right, here it is. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna close my eyes. Flip and I'm gonna listen for your reaction. Just flip it around. Fulminator Mage. Oh, it's alright. It's an alright one. It's alright. It looks fucking cool without about, the frame. Yeah, it's a cool card. It's about 50 bucks, but definitely on the lower end that you can pull. But, but it still... will definitely go up. All of these will go up. If you get one of these, people listening, people watching, make sure you hold on to it right now. Do not sell right now. Just go. Yeah, if you're trying to beat everybody to market, everybody's doing it right now, so you're right. just going to be undercutting people trying to move it, and then in the long run, you'll end up being somebody who just sold it for, no. like, way less Compared. Than, than it was all worth. Of these, all of these should be. Guys, thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate y'all's support. If you like the videos, like what we're doing, like, subscribe. Let us know in the comments of yeah, just what go, videos y'all like. Buttons. We uh, we always appreciate y'all. Don't have anything else to say. I'm tapped out. I'm tapped out. Excellent. Bye.